people judging me for not doing it, for not fitting in, not being able to go have fun, not being able to hang out with my friends, vacations not being as much fun, no way to de-stress after work. The University of Washington conducted a scientific study on our process uh, in the first quarter of 2023. They took 163 participants through our Project 90 process, and the end result was is that it reduced drinking by 98%. And that's just the same process that we've been running now since 2018. Uh, and we've got people who enroll in that process every single day. And so we're about to discuss that process now uh, with David, which is exactly the same process which we have running uh, today as we're recording this in 2024. So for our listener who maybe is unaware of that, what were your fears going into it and what actually was your experience like during those 90 days? Yeah. So my fears were somewhat unrelated to the Project 90 itself, to the program itself. My fears were more related to um, just not having alcohol in my life. Um, it became such a big piece. So, you know, not being able to go have fun, not being able to hang out with my friends, not um people judging me for not for not doing it for not fitting in um vacations not being as much fun no way to de-stress after work and just relax um those are some of the big things just i, I sit here and smile now um looking back at those fears but they were real so i know people who are you know who are considering your program or other other ways to to stop they're real. And uh, I understand I, I felt it, but it, uh, you can get over it. And what was the experience like when you were going through the yeah. 90 days? Yeah. What did you yeah. receive? What was helpful? What wasn't helpful? You know, were you triggered during it? Yeah. So it was, uh, just such a great experience, uh, the 90 days and the program. Um, I learned so much from the coaches, um, about, you know, alcohol business, you, you name it. I mean, obviously it's focused on, on alcohol, but you learn a lot about yourself. You learn a lot about, uh, the way people act. You learn a lot about professional life. Um, but bringing brought into that community of people was really the key for me. I mean, there were so many, um, people that I connected with and that I still keep in touch with that I would call my, my close friends, um, from that program. And so having a community of people who you, uh, respect who are um, professionally successful, who are parents, who are doing all those things that you see yourself doing. Um, it makes it really, really good to connect with those people. It makes it an easier journey. Um, and so it was, it was, uh, I would say a little challenging just to to cut it off, but it gets, it just got easier and easier. And, and one of my things that I really focused on during the 90 days was um, just not drinking and everything else was fine. So if I wanted to eat extra candy and eat whatever I wanted, do whatever I wanted during those 90 days, I allowed myself to, uh, without any guilt or without any remorse, you know, it was like, okay, just focus on this one thing, remove this one thing that's holding you back and then see where it goes from there. How much of the early part of project 90 felt like you were having to rely on brute willpower or motivation or white knuckling it and at what stage did that fade away and it started to feel simple or easy um yeah i mean really maybe the first week or two felt like i was a little bit like white if you want to use white knuckling or like forcing it um just as a getting it out of the habit and out of that routine but after that, I learned a lot of, of ways and tools and had the community there to where I didn't feel that way. Um, I had a plan going, you know, something we talked a lot about during the 90 days. I had a plan uh, for most every situation I was going to be in, um, which kind of helped at the beginning. You know, if you're going to go somewhere, be a part of something to have some sort of plan and, and ready to go or some sort of response to why people are asking all these questions on, hey, you're weird. Why don't you drink? Um to have some sort of response, you know, those, those little things that actually help a lot when you're early on and um, feeling some of those pressures. And it just does, it, it got easier and easier, I would say, um, 
really after six months, um, it felt like it was kind of just who I was. Um, I really appreciate the, you know, the 90 days was very key and that was my goal. Um, but for anyone, <laughs> don't want to overwhelm anyone who's out there, but really giving it that full year is, is where it's at. Um, because a lot of the hard, good work that I've done really started out, say, eight to 12 months, where you really get to start reaping a lot of the benefits of being clear minded and having the energy, being back in shape. If you're out of shape, um, it does take time to rewire your your brain and your habits and learn new stuff and all that. So um, I really appreciate the, the Beyond 90 and, and having that year mark as well. Um, because I understand the benefits of now of making it that year.